Hi everyone, welcome to the Droid G channel. Android recovery mode on your Android phone can help you reboot the system, reboot to the bootloader, hang on slash system, update firmware, restore factory settings, and more. It is a very useful tool for Android users as it fixes various Android errors. However, sometimes your Android phone stuck in recovery mode or fast boot mode. Today's video will tell you why is your phone stuck in recovery mode and how to fix Android phone stuck in recovery. Please watch patiently. The following methods are applicable to mobile phone models including Samsung, Huawei, Xiaomi, OnePlus, Vivo, Oppo, Sony, LG, HTC. I believe it will solve your problem for you. First, if your Android phone stuck in recovery mode, the power button doesn't work. Stuck in recovery mode and phone with no system. Phone stuck on Orange Fox recovery mode. Down plus power, works but still stuck on same screen. Tried installing the latest program via, but the phone got stuck in recovery mode. Please first understand the problems that will cause phone stuck in recovery mode. Second, why is your Android phone stuck in recovery mode? A common cause is that one or more of the buttons used to boot into Android recovery mode gets stuck, malfunctions, or simply stops working. Especially if the button of the mobile phone has failed, it is more likely to cause phone stuck in recovery mode due to the failure of the button. If you have flashed a ROM that is not suitable for your phone or flash the correct ROM in a wrong way, your phone may fail to boot the Android system when it is turned on, and thus enter recovery mode. The downloaded application contains a virus. A custom application is downloaded. The fact that the application file is corrupted and unreadable can also be one of the reasons for the problem. Third, what do you do if your phone is stuck in recovery mode? You have several ways to get out of system recovery mode. So, if you want your device to enter normal working mode, here are some things you can try. Method 1 is to check the phone button. The main reason and one of the most common reasons for the phone stuck in recovery mode issue is that one of the buttons on your device is defective or malfunctioning. So, to check if this is the reason your device is stuck in recovery mode, you first need to check if the buttons are working, especially the volume buttons. If possible, turn off your phone to avoid accidentally selecting unwanted options on the Android recovery screen and resulting in data loss. If you have a mobile phone protective case, please remove the mobile phone protective case to fully expose the physical buttons. Press and release each button several times, especially the volume buttons. If the button is stuck or pressed, this may allow the button to return to the correct position and start working properly again. Finally, please restart the computer to see if it gets rid of the recovery mode and starts up normally. Method 2 is to try hard restarting the phone. Another possible solution to fix Android phone stuck in recovery mode issue is to force restart your Android device. In most cases, simply restarting your device will resolve common issues. When the device encounters freezes, freezes, etc., a hard restart is a method worth trying, and it works in many cases. To hard reboot an Android phone, hard reboot the phone with the key combination according to your device model. The Samsung in my hand is the power button and the volume down button. Press and hold the power button for 10 to 15 seconds until you see the manufacturer's logo appear. Please wait patiently to see if the phone returns to the home screen of the phone. Method 3 is to restore factory settings. If force restarting your device doesn't help you get out of Android system recovery mode, performing a factory reset on your phone might help. Follow the steps below to factory reset your Android phone. In the Android recovery mode interface, please use the volume up button and volume down button to select up and down. Please move to the option of restoring factory settings, and use the power button to confirm, which will enter the interface for the second confirmation whether to restore factory settings. After entering the interface for confirming whether to restore the factory settings for the second time, move to select the option of restoring the factory settings and use the power button to confirm. This will trigger the reset process, which should only take 2-3 to three seconds to complete. Once done, it will take you back to the recovery mode interface. Use the power button to select the reboot system now option. Finally. Please check if your phone restarts to the home screen to determine if fix Android stuck in recovery mode. Method 4 is to use ADB commands. After you have tried the above methods, the problem of stuck in recovery mode still exists, then using ADB commands can help you solve the problem. This method only works on rooted Android phones. Please try the following steps. Please download ADB from the official website and install it on your PC. After the installation is successful, you need to connect the phone stuck in recovery mode to the computer with a USB cable. Go to the ADB folder, hold down the shift key on your keyboard, right click any empty space in the folder, and select open command window here. Under the command window, you need to type the command out of devices and press enter. If the output shows that your device is connected, go ahead and type out of reboot and press enter. Then you'll see your phone exit recovery mode and restart normally. Method 5 is to seek professional help. If you have tried all of the above methods and none of them work, there may be a problem with your device itself. Please find the nearest official authorized service center according to your Android device model. Let them help you check what is causing your Android phone stuck in recovery mode and let them fix it. That's all for today's video.
Hopefully one of these methods will get your Android phone back to work. If you think this video is helpful to you and think we did a good job, please like, share and tell us which method helped you solve the problem in the comment area. At the same time, if you think there is room for improvement, you can also express your views and suggestions in the message area. Thanks. Good luck.